Hey you guys, we have um, Teacher Appreciation Day coming up, so I kind of wanted to do a goodie bag for the teachers. So I'm going to be starting off with my clear goodie bags that I always use. These are, I think these are the 9 by 9 So the first thing I am adding into these goodie bags, I'm not going to make them so thick because I will be adding a good amount gift card. The Jot Gemstones, I thought these were so cute. I wanted to get them in the pink, but my Dollar Tree didn't have them in the pink if not i would have used the pink you guys because i thought the pink would have been cuter in here since it teacher appreciation day is february 3rd over here and i kind of figured it's just like valentine's so i wanted to do the pink but you know this is what they had and i went to like three dollar trees just to get the pink and i could not get my hands on it so sorry there's a little something on there so I said, why not use the white? I gotta touch it since it's so nice and clear. I don't even know where the opening is at. So we're gonna start off with that and we're gonna push it to the side. So how cute is that? And these are the chat, they do get 315 and I love this color. Look at that. That is a cute color. Okay. The next thing I want to add is a collagen and mask. I thought this would be cute to add in here. And this is the rose and collagen hydrating under eye pads. I am going to add these a diamond not diamond sorry these pearls these are so cute i bought a ton of them back in the days and i end up using them a ton and they are they do have the glue in the back so they're flat so you could use them for your paper crafting i think these are so cute you can make a letter and add a couple of pearls on the letter or make a card like a gift card or thank you card and add some of those pearls and you get different sizes you get the real large to the real small and i trust me i even use the real tiny ones they stick perfect i decided why not give each teacher one i think this is a great idea for um because they love to make thank you thank you cards so i'm going to add a one and one and i think i'm going to add it with the pearls going up you know how i love to change everything around okay i'm going to add this cute and adorable starbucks um keychain that my friend angie sells uh so i'm gonna go ahead and leave her link down below to her instagram in case you want to buy one i love using these i have one for my car i actually i'm using the the louis vuitton one in the brown but she made me two of these, and I thought they would be perfect for this gift. Because you know how the teachers, they love to carry, and they love to go to Starbucks and carry their keychains and all these things. So she put little tassels on the bottom. Look how cute those tassels are. So I'll leave Angie's um, link down below in case you want to go ahead and purchase one. They are... I don't want to give you a price in case they went up or it changed, but I'll leave it down below and I'll ask her for the price so I can link it to this video, but they are so cute and I know the teachers are going to love them. So I'm going to add these to the side. Let's see if it fits because you know how sometimes stuff just doesn't end up working out for me. So I'm going to do the tassel down and it does fit real nice on the side. So just like that, push it all the way to the back and I'm going to do the same thing to this one. How cute is that? So since I'm not adding a lot to this little goodie bag, I am adding a good gift card amount. I'm doing $25 for each teacher. Okay, let's finish. I'm going to be using these cute, adorable lips that my friend Chrissy gave me for Valentine's. I thought that would be perfect to add to this little project. 
I'm also going to be using my toppers that I made myself. And the boys actually made them a thank you card. So one from Antonio and then one from Manuel. They wrote on them themselves. This is my kindergarten, of course. So funny. And my third grader. So I got to make sure I don't like mix the gifts up which I like to write their names now on their bags. I'm gonna show you right now how. So this is what I mean by writing their names. I had a bunch of these made. As you can tell, look at how many I used already. Next time I'm just gonna make them in this size and I use these for like the school supplies and stuff. So I like, I'm gonna put them in the bags as well. Just so each kid has their own and doesn't get mixed up. I'm doing $25 to Dollar Tree. I thought that would be cool. So they could buy like school supplies you know how they like to buy their own for their students, school supplies and everything. I'm going to be using my little baby bags. So I'm going to slide this in here. And I'm not going to put it in the back. I'm going to put it right in the middle. Like so. This is a thank you card that each of the kids wrote by themselves to their teacher. Okay. So I'm going to put one of these little bags. Just a little clear bag. I'm going to add the gift card. I wrote the amount on the back. Look how cool that is. I'm going to add one of the lips. So I think in this case, I'm going to go with the pink lip. <laughs> how cute is this? That is super cute. The, the lips that Chrissy sent me, there's some in the red. Some in the pink. And then I think some I could paint myself. I'm not sure. Unless they're all painted. No. Some are wood. So you want to do purple lips. That would be so cute. If you could do purple lips, you could do black lips. You can do orange lips. Anything that matches your goodie bag, you can color it and add it on there. It's just going to be a little bonus. And it's going to be so adorable. So I'm really happy I am adding this little detail to it. But since these are already painted, the pink ones, might as well use them. I could have painted my own because she actually sent me the paint as well. So I'll do that next time. I need another color of lips. I think this is cute <laughs> to add it to anything. So I'm going to go ahead and use the pink. I have two colors of the pink toppers so I think I might do the lighter pink and I can't even tell which one yeah this one so I'm gonna do the lighter pink and then I'll leave the dark pink for something else and I also have them in the red because I already had made them for Valentine's so this was perfect to use them for this so with your topper, all you have to do is squeeze it right there. Bring it on to your bag. One staple, two staples. Now you can make a little something and hide the staples. If you're one of those people that are crafty, you can add a little something on there. I really... I am crafty, but not like that. But if you, they add little like hearts and little glue, little bows on there. I'm not that kind of crafty. So <laughs> we're going to go ahead and add this. And this is going to add our wow factor. And I'm going to add it right on top because you're going to see what I'm going to do. How I'm going to close it right now. I'm going to add this one right on top as well. And then... I'm going to actually, I do have two more toppers to close it up with. And I'm going to use the same color. So I'm going to go ahead and use this lighter pink. I'm going to bring it all the way down. And we're going to close it up. So close it. Now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to bend this topper. And I'm going to add it right here look how cute this is gonna look now if you do not want the staple to go through this 
go ahead and bend it down and then close your topper so you can do that as well and what i mean by that is you just bend this down add it here and then close your topper but i think i'm gonna go through the thing because i think it looks prettier like that so let's go ahead and do that so we could bring your topper bend it down and we're gonna staple it right through let's see if it even goes through right now yes it does oh you guys i ran out of staplers let me get back okay you guys so go ahead and refill it with the staples i'm just gonna do that real quick let's go ahead and do the other one so you don't gotta go through it if you don't want to i am i think it looks way better like that i got some bags in the dollar store so on each bag i'm just gonna go ahead and write the kid's name just so i have this the, the gift card the gift card the card that each kid wrote to go with the goodie bag you see this is my ones so this goodie bag will go in this bag you guys can add some tissue in here if you guys choose to i think they came out super cute and they fit perfect so if you don't want it to stick up, go ahead and bend it. Like I said, you can always bend it. But I don't care. I think it looks prettier like that. And then the other kid. That way they're... Thank you card to the teacher. Doesn't get mixed up. So there you go, you guys. Two cute, affordable gifts. Go ahead and make them expensive. Add an expensive gift card to them if you want. Go ahead and make it affordable. Add a $10 gift card. Just make sure you tell the teachers thank you. So from me and the kids, thank you to all the teachers here who have been working through this pandemic so I can go to work. Thank you for everything. I hope you guys like this video. Give me a thumbs up. Comment down below. And until next time, bye, you guys.